adventures of wine tasting on the peninsula. But we're gonna try a few different ones, one like family owned, and then one bigger wine yeah. winery as well. We're gonna try some really good wines. You know, we know our stuff here. <laughs> we're going to discover what makes Croatian wines unique. And like all things, it's going to be a journey to get there. Cliffside vineyards, gallons of wine aged underwater, and family traditions. Let's get stuck into some of the wines of Dalmatia. It's beeping at me that I'm falling off the cliff. Oh. Thanks. Well, our first yeah. stop on the peninsula. Hey! Hello. Ashley. Josip. Nice, nice to meet you. Josip, nice to meet you, Stanka. This is Josip, a winemaker from Pelyashats. Oh, wow. Yeah, so now we go like into all part. We're going into a cave. All part of the winery. Did family members lay these stones? Yes. Actually, uh -huh. my father made it. Really? <laughs> Tunnels to leading to paradise. No. <laughs> wow. We don't age our wine in the new oak because we don't want any taste from the oak in the wine. So the oldest barrel is from 1942. So how long has your family been making wine? So this is one of the oldest family wineries, so we produce the wine in our family more than 500 years. Here it's the natural temperature without any air condition or anything. Wow. So it's giving good temperature and good humidity because good temperature, good wine, good company now. <laughs> Josip taught us a lot, and it was fascinating to learn about the conditions that make great wine. It's on the perfect position, on the south face, where we have lots of sun here. It's very steep, we can't use any machine here. From only one kind of the grape, we can produce big selection. This peninsula is famous by Klavac Mali, so it's 80 to 90% of the same grape on this peninsula. Well, it's a good thing I love red wines, and so does yeah. Stanka. <laughs> <laughs> Big glass for a big wine. <laughs> so now we'll taste the Stagnum. It's very complex, tasteful, full body. That's 10 year old, but it's still young. If you make good balance between alcohol, acidity, tannins, we can age the wine for a long time. Yeah. It tastes so good. This is excellent. This soil, it's very unique. In the winter time, it keeps humidity for the long in the summer time. And the roots go very deep in the soil. So when the deeper roots go, it's better, good, better quality of the wine. Croatia, it's in the world still unknown country, like the wine country, but now it's coming more and more popular, so. Mm. This is really nice. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for having us. <laughs> With our heads full of facts and the trunk full of Josip's wine, Stanka and I cut through the valley to one of Croatia's biggest wineries, Matushko. So would you say this is one of the largest wineries on Pelješac yes. Peninsula? Or yes. is the largest? It, it is. It is. It is the uh -huh. Great. This is Mato and Mato, father and son and winemakers. Oh my gosh, it keeps going. Yes, it keeps going. It's really large. You can get lost here. Uh, our family is making wines for 500 years. So I kind of compare Dingach only being called Dingach is how you can only really be called Champagne, Champagne if it's from Champagne, yeah. France. It's yeah. nearly the same thing. It looks yeah. like a difficult place to pick yeah. the grapes. <laughs> it, it is. It, it's very di difficult. But when people ask why it's expensive, we because just of the take hard them work. To and they know. Then everything. they see it, and you're like, yeah. "This is why." <laughs> Here, are these all these barrels full? Yeah, and Dingach we hold it for six months. I wouldn't mind bringing one of these home, you know. I think we need a we'll bigger talk about car. That later. The old amphoras was are found in the sea. In the bottom yeah. of the sea, yeah. yeah. That's that was for wine and, and olive oil. You can that's buy an amphora, amphora full, full of wine? Yes. That's the best idea I've ever heard of. Wow. That's such a good idea. I love it. I've noticed the donkey is on your labels. What is the importance of the donkey here in Dalmatia? The donkey did everything. Transporting the grapes, transporting the wine. But you're not using them anymore? Not using them anymore. How come? Ah, cars were invented. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> Pelia Shots is the place that everyone must visit when coming to Croatia because this is where some of the winemaking really started 500 yes, plus think, years ago. Yes, yes, yes. And you have to continue this tradition. Yes. I heard your father, he said you must. <laughs> yes, I must. I was born like that. Yeah, and you will. Not will. you must, you I will. I will do it, yes. <laughs> Super. Would you say you're drinking a glass of wine every day? <laughs> they say red wine's good. This size of the glass. Uh, yeah, this, ah, okay, ah, I like yeah. that. 